I am going to a Christian rap concert. Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Kamani, because that's the name of mine. Clothing line, we are going to have an interesting day today. I am going to a Christian rap concert. I've never been to one before. The performer at this concert is Miles. Oh, I forgot his last name. It seemed real cute. They, 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 uh, they get lit for the Lord. Okay, I know that's right. Now, I'm definitely not new to the Christian rap game. Y'all will be surprised. A lot of people are asleep on Christian rappers. Like the songs be going so hard that I be forgetting it's a Christian song. Like, and child, hopefully God will allow my future husband to cross paths with me. Cause dang, where you at? Cause I'm gonna pull up at the concert and be like, so that's where the godly men at. But I'm also keeping a, a thousand. Um, I'm not there for a man. I am there to turn up with Jesus. You know what, actually comment down below how many times I said Christian rap concert. Mm. She looks all cute like this, but I'm gonna fluff her and make her big once I do my makeup. Surprisingly, I get a lot of people asking me for a makeup tutorial, and I'm so sorry that I haven't, <laughs> I haven't had a chance to do it. I would do it now, but I'm already running behind. And you know what, while I am beating my face, I'll tell y'all a little story time. Since we are going to a Christian rap concert, let's talk about the goodness of the Lord. So I wanna say this incident happened maybe like, mm, I wanna say two years ago. And during this time of my life, um, I was going through a lot. <laughs> child I just moved out of my roommate situation because one of the roommates tried to grape me and don't worry about me child because he got sent to the hospital not me my dog passed away I injured my leg to the point to where I had to wear a boot for nine months which caused me to lose my waitress job and all of that happened within the same month honey call me Job I already purchased tickets to this church conference that I follow online. This used to be my uh, favorite church and their conference was located in Tulsa, Oklahoma and I'm in California. Before all that drama and chaos happened, I already booked my ticket, booked my flight, whatever, whatever. So I was gonna go. I went by myself, which wasn't a problem with me. So I go to this conference alone and it actually was a vibe. I really did enjoy myself. So it was the last day and it was a three day conference. And I guess uh, we were on like the second to last uh, session of the day. They were just focusing on like prayer, like literal prayer. Overall, everyone was praying while people on stage were singing and at one point I think there was even a painter painting a picture of Jesus or you know whichever right so I'm praying and I feel myself starting to get like a little bit emotional and I'm like uh-uh don't do that because we done enough of that for the past couple of weeks and I don't want to keep getting emotional I'm here by myself I'm I'm not gonna do that today and as I'm praying you know I felt God say, it's okay, you can be vulnerable with me. And I'm just thinking back in my head like, mm, yeah, but I'm not, I don't know none of these folks. I don't know nobody here. So I'm not gonna be hooting and hollering and crying and I'm here by myself. I'll just cry to you when I get home. After I had that little conversation with God in my head, the lady next to me, to my left, pat me on my shoulder and was like, hey, um, I'm so sorry to, bother you but I just have to be obedient um God wanted me to tell you that no one's out to get you anymore and your hard times are behind you and I'm like okay 
love. Thank you, ma'am. Like, I didn't know how to feel about that. Then a couple more minutes go by and you know, and I'm still praying. You know that feeling in your stomach, chest and throat when you're about to cry or you're getting emotional and it's like shaky. That's how I was feeling the entire time, but I was thugging it out and I was not about to cry. And I was really holding back. I felt God say, what is something that you think I can't do for you? And in my head, I said, you can't hug me. Tell me why. The same lady to my left rubs my back and, and grabs my arm like this. And she said, I'm so sorry, can you stand up for me? I'm like, okay. You just interrupted my prayer, rude, but okay. So I stand up and she hugs me. And I'm like, weirded out at this point. <laughs> I'm just sitting here like, okay, cause I don't believe in coincidences like at all. One of the things that the pastor uh, said at the conference was, don't feel hesitant to ask God for confirmation. Cause if you ask him for confirmation, he gonna show you and that's for sure. I did just that. As I'm hugging this random woman, I said in my head, God, can you confirm this is you? Pause. Before I could even finish that sentence in my head, the woman whispers in my ear and says, God wants me to tell you that he's holding you right now. Oh my God, I'm not about to cry right now. I'm really not. <laughs> when I told you I broke down, I broke down like it was almost as if I had no control. I broke down to the point to where like my knees got weak, I'm collapsing and the lady is holding me up and I'm crying. At one point I was thinking in my head like, okay girl, like you cried, you got it out, stop crying, what you doing? It got to the point to where I couldn't even control my body, bruh. It felt like I was in the sunken place. I told myself to get up and I couldn't. Like it was very, Scary, I'll just say that much. Have you ever been to church and you be seeing people like falling out screaming and hollering and all that? That was me. I'm like, I know I am not that girl right now. Whenever I tried to stop crying, it was painful. Like in my stomach. When the lady that was hugging me spoke in tongues, it was over, bruh. It was over. Like whatever was on me left. I was crying for probably about 20 minutes straight. That's kind of a long time to cry in public. So, um, yeah, that was interesting. After I was done crying, I felt lighter. Like, you know, whenever you feel shame or you feel anxiety or you feel tense and stressed or whatever like that, I felt none of that. Like, it was like a peace that surpasses all understanding. Oh! Okay, that's what it was. Pretty much, God is good. <laughs> okay, that's all I'm gonna say with that. So let me go ahead and finish beating my face and I'll be right back. <laughs> I beat the face on all. concert but this is a christian rap concert so <laughs> i can't look sexy i don't think i can wear a dress hold on y'all i think i got it <laughs> <laughs> yeah read the shirt <laughs> read the shirt <laughs> treat me like a gift from god or leave me alone period this might be extra, but <laughs> I'm extra. <laughs> Besides the fact I sound like a, a churro cart every time I walk, this outfit key. Okay, I'm happy with this outfit. But it worked out. So let's have a good time. God, I've been walking in peace. Gave me the key. I know that it's critical. Now that I'm here, I see everything that I need. Found in the principle. And walking in fear, I'm still going back to the past. <laughs> it really been minimal. I'm gonna follow the king. I got a key. Now that I follow the principle. And I'm good. And I'm lit. I got God, so I don't need a trip. Give him everything that I mean. Off in the head, and I know I won't miss. <laughs> No, 
know what time it is, man. It's yeah. Bay Area. Yeah. You know what time You know when we on this glow, or you gotta go. You understand whoa, whoa, me? Got it, I. Oh boy. Somebody tell the industry my squad coming. Nah. Tell the industry my God coming. Nah. Well, you better watch your mouth like your child coming. Nah. Smoke fest, smoke fest, it's a wild summer. Oh, you're the mess. And like that, you hear me? I hey. he gave my life to Christ, he was really all I needed. I'm on the winning team, tell me how I could get defeated. Squabble cold on my mama, I'd have knocked a couple demons. I let God take control, now he the driver and the whip. The C stand for Christ, baby, this don't stand for Crip. Grew up on swiping EBT and mama using whip, but God blessing me with chili, I ain't have to flip a brick. Is you riding for the Lord or is you hanging with the sucker side? I know what I be on, so it ain't much for me to justify. The Bible is my weapon, I done went and got it customized. All praise to the most high, over here he getting glorified. I left the world alone cause I see Sin is what they normalize, living in revelation We ain't going back to normal times, the Lord is all I need I'm the branches and he is the vine, I'm ten toes down I don't want and got my faith in line It's a holy function, don't invite me to no kickback Jesus! Jesus! I went viral when I said I don't drink, I don't cuss, I don't smoke And everybody came and tried to roast Then there's love in the comments when these rappers talking murder and they post Y'all about to make me do the most Things over low key for like a hood crime I don't got a road to weed to have a good time I don't just preach this on a Sunday breast